Just a couple notes on equipment. Uh, what I've got here is just a small single burner atmospheric forge run by a propane tank. This, uh, this is going to be my heat source for this particular demonstration. And as you can see, the steel doesn't have to be yellow hot in order to warm up the oil. You're just looking for thermal mass. You want to get it warm. At that point, you want to get over to that oil quench as quickly as you possibly can, humanly possibly, anyway, uh, and get it in there. Here's the flip side of the same knife. You can definitely see the zones of different hardnesses and different heat treats on this particular knife. Uh, again, this should uh, wind up as a very, very useful tool. One thing you might want to consider uh, if you're going to do any amount of blade making at all is a programmable temperature controlled oven. Uh, again, this thing is worth its weight in gold. You can see we're at 90 degrees right now. This thing will easily go way past 90 and that can, it'll even come back. You can go the other way with it too. And back. And back. Straighten it out. Well, this is the carnage from our day's testing. And there will be some victims in this too. Some of this cardboard and this rope is pretty much destined for the trash barrel. But as you can see with proper heat treat, a little bit of education on the steels and, and materials you use, you can really come up with some, some interesting stuff.